always loved your concept. I drive by it all the time on Route Set on Interstate 78. But I have to tell you, I was hoping that you would do a public offering so that people would get to know Box better. How are they going to get to know it now that you're just doing it with a SPAC? Well, that's uh, one of the big reasons why I'm here on, on your show. But overall, uh, uh, we felt like SPAC product was great for us because of two main things. One was the quantum of capital that we can raise that we can then use to drive marketing, drive assortment expansion. Uh, and then two, uh, the ability to really tell the story of our B2B business recovering after a difficult year last year with COVID, uh, as well as our SaaS business. So uh, it's the reason why we went to SPAC. And there are trade-offs with SPAC versus a traditional IPO process. But we think uh, the SPAC product or the SPAC route was the best one for us. Well, now you mentioned inspirational. The reason why we had you uh, off the charts, because I was just so uh, taken by your story personally. And I want you to share it with people because it's pretty inspirational in itself. Yeah, you know, we started off uh, in a garage uh, in tropical New Jersey, uh, just central Jersey, if you believe that there is a central Jersey. Uh, but overall, humble beginnings. So uh, I, I grew up uh, as, a, as a child of immigrant parents uh, um, uh, without a bunch, without a silver spoon in my mouth. And to be able to live the American dream and to be on your show today and to drive uh, a business to the point where we're about to be a public company while doing what's right for the front lines, for those same folks that look a lot like my family when we first came to America, um, it really is the American dream personified. Don't miss a second of Mad Money. Follow at Jim Kramer on Twitter. Have a question? Tweet Kramer. Hashtag Mad Tweets. Send Jim an email to madmoney at cnbc.com or give us a call at 1-800-743-CNBC. Miss something? Head to madmoney.cnbc.com. Shepard Smith here. Thanks for watching CNBC on YouTube.